you spoke about how the left builds narratives and they have successfully to an extent also built that narrative about say for example chief minister yogi adityanath being this militant monk or uh, say karnataka for instance being the uttar pradesh of the south so you know regardless of which ideologies you may subscribe to or which party you may vote for that is slightly discerning not out of disrespect to any other state but because our state has its own characteristics we want to respect uh, you know but as a political spokesperson how would you respond to this you see i'll tell you something if there was if there is militancy in sanyas um uh, you know then i don't know what to say because sanyas is about giving up and so if you were to call a sanyasi a militant i really do not know because maybe the militancy is of thought of of uh, you know belief in this nation and its greatness uh, so what if you call that militancy i don't think we should have an issue i will give you a simple answer to this because i'll i'll just quickly quote what swami vivekananda said in his 1893 that famous speech that we all know right i am proud to belong to a religion which has taught the world both tolerance and universal acceptance he said we believe not only in universal toleration but we accept all religions as true i am proud to belong to a nation which has sheltered the persecuted and the refugees of all religions and all nations of the earth this is what swami vivekananda said basically he spoke of what a great religion hindu 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 uh, the sanatana dharma religion itself is the hindu religion itself is and how we have allowed all other religions to thrive on our soil this is what he said now what does the textbook say the textbook also has a lesson on swami vivekananda the textbook says all religions preach tolerance all religions say what sanatana dharma says is what vivekananda says so effectively they have dared to misquote swami vivekananda i hope i am being clear he says we accept all religions as true he has not said all religions accept all religions as true because there is a religion which calls me kafir they don't accept me as true there is a religion that believes that their god is the supreme that others aren't we are the ones who say ekam sat vipra bahuda vadanti we are the ones who say interpretations are many right but the truth is one however they have conveniently camouflaged and misquoted people as great as swami vivekananda for the simple reason that they are driving this pseudo secularism that sidramaya subscribes to of his ahinda of of all the politics that he does see this essentially is what this textbook revision committee has done and if we are being called as being modeled after up so be it not only uh, has uh, you know yogi adityanath uh, ji come back to power with a thumping majority he has given people the kind of development they have not seen in 75 years so we are proud if we are being compared to him 